and ahead of the anticipated November election, one Houston bakery is giving customers a chance to unofficially vote early with cookies. Marcelino Benito takes us inside. It's a lot of fun for us to do this. At Three Brothers Bakery. We decided to start it a little earlier. Early voting just got underway. We have customers from from the left to the right and in between. On the menu, a choice between Abbott and Beto. Your ballot, a tasty cookie. If you want to come in and, and get Abbott cookies, great. If you want to come in and get Beto cookies, great. If you want Gingies, great. Come on in. Three Brothers is back with their famous cookie poll. It has a track record of success. In 2016, it predicted a Trump victory. Four years later, the poll called a Biden win. And now for the first time, they're trying the race for governor. People are very, very interested in what's happening in politics right now uh, in the government and Texas and they they want to they want to show their opinion of what's going on by these cookies. Just a few days in, Beto's jumped out to a big lead with 29 cookies sold. Abbott coming in at five cookies and two have gone third party gingy. It's all based on on who buys what and and we'll just kind of wait and see what happens. In a year where it feels so much is on the line and the issues couldn't be greater, customers letting their true feelings show through a cookie. We have had people that come in and say, oh, give me one of those and I'm going to bite the head off, you know, I'm like, OK, whatever, we're OK with that. But no matter where you fall politically, Three Brothers hopes that cookie pushes you closer to the only poll that really matters. If you're going to buy cookies, great. We would love for you to come. But don't forget to vote because that's really super important. And that was Marcelino Benito reporting. 12, and remember now, 12 News is your election headquarters, and we will continue our November elections coverage as we get closer.